having babies in Minecraft. In a few minutes, there's gonna be a natural disaster, and we each have to build the safest home for our kids to see who's the best parent. Uh, but wait, I'm already a baby. And, oh, yeah, right. Well, uh, I guess let me go ahead and press this button to spawn in all of our babies, and boom, there we go. Aw, my baby is so cute. <laughs> Speaker babies, dang it, it's so tiny. And, um, <laughs> <laughs> Please don't make fun of him. You know what? Your name is going to be Stuart. And okay. Well, anyways, I'm not sure how much time we have until the natural disaster. So do we better get to building cute? Let me go ahead and grab some reinforced purple concrete. Because remember, guys, we have to make this the safest house ever. Oh, yeah. We don't even know what's coming. It could be a tornado. It could be a tsunami. What's going to happen? And yeah, you're right. It could be a volcano. It could be a meteor. We don't know. But here, let me go ahead and start building the outline of my house. Yeah, we need to make our houses super safe in order to protect our babies. I'm going to give baby Ruby the safest house ever. My house is going to be the best, guys. So you could go ahead and, uh, you know, stop trying. And okay, okay, we'll see about that. But wait a minute, hold on. I just got a really good idea. While you guys are all building your house over here on the floor, like, you know, normal people, I'm going to go ahead and do slash slash wand really quick. And let me just go ahead and quickly select my entire house. Uh, wait, Dash, what are you doing? Oh, don't worry about it. I'm just going to go ahead and do slash slash move uh, 30 and boom. There we go. I'm going to build a sky base. Wait, you're building a sky base? What if there's a tornado? Well, of course, my house is going to be stabilized and everything. So even if there is a tornado, uh, nothing's going to happen. But guys, this is going to be so OP against like, I don't know, a zombie apocalypse or like volcano or meteors or something like that. This is going to be awesome. If it's going to be meteors, it's just going to hit your house first. Uh, no, it's actually uh, going to go underneath my house. Uh, yeah. And then hit the floor beneath it. It's definitely not going to hit my house. That's not how meteors work. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure that's how they work. I'll just put like a big sign on top of my house saying if you're a meteor uh, go around and then they'll all listen I, I don't think they will yeah 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 whatever but uh, let's say there's a volcano or something and then lava is flowing everywhere my house is the only one that's gonna be safe uh, no look what I'm doing right now uh okay and wait what are you doing and whoa what in the world why are you building your thing so big uh, because I need to have the best house for my kid of course uh okay well you might have the biggest house but I'm gonna have the best house so here let me go ahead and grab a little bit of reinforced oak wood because I want to make my house look nice and also be like uh you know really fun Functional. And here, let me just go ahead and start with the entrance right over here. And hold on, wait, instead of using a normal door, I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these reinforced doors right over here with a button so that nothing is gonna be able to get in. And, uh, wait, hold on, a button doesn't even work. How are you supposed to open up these reinforced doors? Uh, wait, maybe you have to power it with something else besides a button if it's a reinforced door. Ah, uh, hold on, let me try using a lever maybe. Is this gonna work? Let me just go ahead and put the lever right over here. And uh, the lever doesn't work either. Okay, hold on, uh, let me see. Is there any other things I could use? Wait, let me try something. Let me just uh, open sesame. <laughs> what? Did you just spit on my door? That's not going to work. What in the world? Okay, hold on. I'm pretty sure what I actually have to do is use one of like these uh, inventory scanners, key card readers, one of these things. So let me try grabbing this thing called a retinal scanner. And hold on. Is this going to work? And oh my gosh, that is so sick. Hold on. Whenever I look at it, it's going to open up. And uh, I'm pretty sure this makes it so that only I can go inside of my house and no one else can go in. Okay, this is perfect. If only you can go inside of your house. Uh, what about your baby? And oh, wait, uh, that's a good point. But wait a minute. Hold on. I just realized I'm pretty sure my baby has like the same face as me. So he should be able to go in as well. And yeah, we should be good. And whoa, wait, uh, speaker baby. What in the world is this? Uh, this is my house. Can you not tell? Are you building a cake? Uh, yeah, go back to building your house. Don't look at mine. And Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. And wait, Ruby, what are you building? You've like barely got any progress done. Hey, don't be mean. I'm doing my best. Uh, yeah, but look at how much I have built. I have two giant cubes. And whoa, yeah, speaking about your cubes, what in the world is your plan with these speaker, man? It, it looks like two uh, red cubes, literally. Uh, yeah, I'm making a staircase between them so I can have them interlinked, and this is going to be awesome. Okay, okay, that actually sounds pretty interesting, but here, now let me go ahead and just start making my house look super nice. It's gonna be the nicest looking and safest house you've ever seen. I don't know about nicest looking and safest. Knowing you, you're probably just gonna, like, make a bunch of dispenser traps that could, like, probably hurt your child. What? No, if I build any dispenser traps, they're gonna be to stop intruders so that I can keep my child even safer, okay? But anyways, here, now let me go ahead and quickly add in all of my walls. Boom! There we go. In fact, I think I can go ahead and make this a little bit longer, so let me do that. There we go. That looks about good. Let me go ahead and do the same right over here. Boom! And here, now let me go ahead and close it all off. And wait, is that what you're building your most secure base out of a uh, wood and hey okay i told you i'm aiming to make my house look nice and be super safe and you know wood can be safe i just gotta build correctly i don't know about that you could try to make it safe but i don't think it is well i'll have other defenses okay i don't need to build everything out of reinforced concrete and stuff reinforced concrete is cool but it doesn't look that nice i'm not gonna lie uh, you could definitely make it look nice i mean look what i'm doing and oh wait actually yeah your base does look pretty cool but uh still wood looks nicer i don't know about that and hey remember this is supposed to be a house for our kids and you know if it doesn't look nice then they're probably not gonna 
going to be very happy. So uh, that's also going to be pretty important. Oh, then I guess your child's going to be super sad. And uh, what? No, dude. My child is going to be the happiest one out of all of them here. Whoa, sick bird speaker, baby. I can't believe you said that. And oh my gosh, that was not funny. Okay, my house is going to be the best looking one here. At, wait, actually, hold on. Uh, what, uh, what in the world happened over here? Hold on. I think I accidentally broke some of my logs. Why does this look so weird over here? All right. Well, anyways, there we go. The first part of my house is complete. It is looking sick. But anyway, now I need to go ahead and, you know, like actually start building some stuff on the inside for my baby. So, hmm, what could I build? And wait a minute. I just got a banger idea. Okay, so since our kids are going to be like staying inside of their houses for a long time because of the natural disaster, they're going to need some sort of like entertainment, right? That's true. I don't want my baby to get bored. Exactly. So I'm going to go ahead and build an arcade room inside of my house. This is going to be so epic. What have you guys ever seen a house with an arcade room inside of it? Uh, rich people. Oh, yeah. My house is going to be the most epic, uh, the millionaire, uh, the rich house ever. It's going to be so epic. Oh, yeah, that's actually a pretty good idea. I'm probably going to copy that if I'm going to be honest. And wait, what? You're going to steal my idea? Well, you know what? It's fine. I can still make it like better. So here, let me go ahead and just put down the doors for the arcade room. Boom. There we go. And now let me go ahead and start putting down all of the arcade machines. This is going to be so sick. So boom. Let me just go ahead and put them all down like that. And I'm pretty sure I can actually play these arcade games as well. And oh, yeah, check it out. Look, I can play Tetris, guys. Here, I'm going to pop off in Tetris. You guys ready? Wait, you're playing Tetris? And oh, yeah, I'm going crazy on Tetris right now. I'm pretty sure I just have to build the tallest tower and then I win, right? Uh, no, that's not how you play Tetris, but... That's I'm... how you lose Tetris, actually. And Wait, what? No, you guys are wrong. Hold on. Let me just get this tower done really quick. Come on, come on here. And... <gasps> Oh, wait, did I win? And, uh, oh, I, wait, I don't think I won. What the heck do you have in your house? What is this? And, hey, what are you doing here, dude? It's a work in progress, okay? This is just the arcade room, uh, the first part of the arcade room. I still got a lot of work to do. Well, you need to work more on your progress because this is bad. Uh, what do you have in your house? Hold on, I want to take a look at what you've got. Uh, nothing, it's top secret, get out. Oh, my gosh, all right, fine, 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 whatever. All right, well, here, let me go back over here in my house really quick. And here, I think the next thing I need to do to make this arcade room look really nice is go ahead and grab a bunch of carpet. And I'm just going to go ahead and put this carpet all over the floor to give it like a cool design. Oh, that's a good idea. Wait, what color are you using? It better be orange, the best color. And what? No, I'm not going to use orange. I'm using purple because uh, I, obviously that's the best color. Uh, that is obviously incorrect. Um, actually, magenta's the best color. And what? Magenta? Yeah, that's like the same thing as purple. Okay, so uh, purple wins. Uh, I'm sorry to let you guys know, but uh, red's clearly the best color. So uh, you could just quit your yapping. It's not the same. And the, what, what do you mean? It, it literally looks like identical pretty much here. Uh, let me demonstrate. Let me go ahead and grab some purple and magenta wool and here ruby check this out let me go ahead and place them right over here for you and look like those almost look identical no they're clearly different uh no they're not uh, wait speaker baby hold on come out of your house i want to show you something i want to get your thoughts on this okay i'm on my way all right all right and yeah yeah, yeah check this out uh, are these the same colors mm, i don't really think so but they both don't look good what okay you know what well i'm going back to my arcade room uh, that's enough of that yeah yeah whatever magenta's better and okay okay whatever well anyways here let me just go ahead and finish up my arcade room really quick i think the next thing i need to do is go ahead and add in some lights so let me see do we have any sort of lights that i can use and oh wait actually hold on i'm pretty sure this one looks pretty cool and okay yeah here i'm just gonna go ahead and put a few of these around my arcade room just to keep things lit up boom there we go this is starting to look sick all right well while you're building arcade and some lights for your child i'm building all a whole bouncy castle. And wait, while you're building a bouncy castle? Wait, can I see it? That actually sounds like a really good idea. No, you can't see it because then you'd steal my idea. Now go away. And, okay, okay, fine. But wait, that actually gives you a really good idea. What about I build an entire petting zoo in my house? That's gonna be sure to keep my baby entertained. What? A petting zoo? Won't that like get smelly after a while? Uh, no, because I'm gonna build it in like a big glass enclosure. So, you know, it's fine. Nothing's gonna go wrong. What if one of the animals tries to bite your baby? And, uh, well, I'm gonna make sure they don't do that, okay? They're gonna be like super well trained and all that and nothing's gonna go wrong and don't animals smell really bad and yeah dude i already said i'm putting them in a glass enclosure so that their smell doesn't go out uh, i don't think glass enclosures will help you there yeah 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 whatever we'll see about that but anyways now let me just go ahead and uh here let me go ahead and put some stairs over here and i'm just gonna cover the floor with grass because i'm pretty sure animals like to you know like sit on grass and here let me just go ahead and set this entire floor into some grass really quick just like that boom there we go and okay what else do i need for my petting zoo well I need a way to keep the animals, like, happy and all that so that they don't try biting my kids. So, wait, here, let me go ahead and put down some trees for them because uh, I'm pretty sure animals like trees, right? Well, maybe monkeys. And, oh, yeah, monkeys. That's a good idea. I haven't really thought about what animals I should put in here. But, yeah, I'm definitely going to go ahead and put some monkeys in here. Let me grab their spawn egg really quick and... Boom, there we go. I've got a monkey, and whoa, this guy looks so sick. Oh, yeah, and uh, I'm probably gonna win here. Uh, I just turned my uh, little bouncy castle into an entire full-blown fun house.
house. Wait, what's the difference between a bouncy castle and a fun house? And yeah, wait, hold on. Those two sound like the same thing, kind of. Well, a fun house has like a bunch of different activities for you to do, and a bouncy castle is just like a, a bouncy castle. That's pretty it. And uh, okay, well, what type of activities do you have? Uh, wouldn't you like to know so you could steal them? I'm not telling you. What, dude? I'm not gonna steal them. My things are already like much nicer. I don't even need to steal your ideas. And okay, it looks like my monkey over here is doing good in the enclosure. Uh, I added some water so he can like drink it if he gets thirsty. I mean, how is a fun house supposed to stop natural disasters? Uh, it's not. It's for the inside to have fun because, you know, I'm going to have a kid in here. How is your kid going to have fun when there's a tornado outside? Uh, because I'm going to build the best base and it's not going to affect him inside at all. And okay, okay. But anyways, I just finished up my petting zoo and it is so sick. I've got a small monkey and I've also got a big gorilla. Oh, a gorilla? Gorillas scare me, actually. Wow, how? Gorillas are so nice. They're like the friendliest animals in the entire uh, animal kingdom. Yeah, they are pretty friendly. They're just like little people. But they're so muscly. Yeah, speaker man, I want to call them little. This guy looks jacked. But anyways, uh, what do I build next? I got to build some more stuff for my kid and... <gasps> Wait a minute, what about a go-kart track? That is gonna be so epic! Can your baby drive? And, um, wait, actually, that's a pretty good point. Uh, can my baby drive? Well, I'll teach him, you know? I'll, I'll have a go-kart track where he can learn how to drive, in, and I'll have, like, garages for cars and everything, and yeah. Well, here, the first thing I have to do is go ahead and grab some concrete so that I can, like, actually build the track, and wait, I'm gonna make this the most epic track ever. I'm gonna make it go outside of my house. But if it's outside of your house, wouldn't that be where the natural disasters are? And wait, that is a good point, but I just got an even better idea. What if I have it go outside of my house? Except I cover the entire thing with a bunch of reinforced glass. That way, none of the natural disasters can even, like, affect it. Whoa, then your kid can go-kart while they see the natural disaster. Exactly! It's gonna be such a cool experience. But anyways, here, the first thing I should probably do is build, like, a little garage area over here so that, you know, he can actually, like, get a go-kart. Yeah, such a great idea. I can't wait for my son to go go-karting in the middle of a thunderstorm! Yeah, wait, doesn't that sound epic? Uh, no. What if, like, a, a lightning strikes the glass and just, boom, breaks it all? And, uh, well, it's not gonna break it because it's reinforced glass. Don't you know, reinforced glass? First class is like almost unbreakable. You said almost, so it can be broken. Yeah, but not by a puny lightning strike. Like, like what even is lightning? It's just like a little bit of electricity, you know? That's not gonna do anything. Actually, lightning is static electricity. Okay, but anyways, I'm also gonna make sure to make everything super strong. So I'm gonna go ahead and use some of this reinforced concrete for my walls, just in case anything tries to like damage the garage. Wait, can I use your go-kart course? I want my kid to race your kid. And oh, wait a minute, that actually gives me a good idea. Yeah, for sure. We should have like an epic go-kart battle with all of our kids on the go-kart track. That's gonna be so sick. Uh, well, my kid's definitely gonna win because he's already taken after me and I'm, you know, the smartest and the best. Uh, I'm not sure about all that. My kid's gonna have the most experience since the go-kart track is literally gonna be, like, in his house. Yeah, well, why don't I make a go-kart track in my house so my kid gets more experience than yours? And, wait, th th weren't you just saying that you didn't like the idea of a go-kart track? Now you wanna build one and copy my idea? Yeah, just so my kid could beat yours. A lot in the world. Alright, well, uh, my go-kart track is gonna be better, so my kid's gonna get better go-kart training, uh, so, yeah, but anyways, here, now let me go ahead and quickly grab all of the go-karts boom and here i'll just go ahead and put down six there we go and now it's time to start building the actual go-kart track and i'm gonna make it like spin around my entire house and just like loop it's gonna be so epic i don't know why you're wasting your time building a go-kart track because i know what babies actually want and it's cookies and cake and wait what you're building cookies and cake for a baby oh yeah i mean your entire house is literally a cake but uh, doesn't that sound kind of unhealthy you know shouldn't he be eating uh, a, like good healthy food yeah your baby is gonna have tummy aches all the time healthy schmelty who cares cookies and kick her the best. Well, I mean, guys, he is a baby, so he's probably, like, the most experienced of what to do. And, oh, wait, that is a good point, but is he gonna make a good parent? That's the real question. Uh, I don't know, but I, I guess he's probably gonna make a good friend, at least. And, oh, yeah, I guess Speaker Baby's gonna be, like, a friend of his own kid, but anyways, my go-kart track is coming along so well. This turn that I'm making right over here is so smooth, it's gonna be so epic. Well, while you guys are trying to have fun, I'm actually going to make actual food for my kid. I'm building a kitchen. And, oh, yeah, building a normal kitchen is probably a good idea. I'm probably gonna copy that. I don't want my kid to starve or anything. Hey, don't copy my idea. And, oh, it's a kitchen. You did not invent kitchens, okay? Actually, you guys are copying my idea because I've been started on my kitchen way before you guys have. Uh, guys, a kitchen is not an idea you copy. Uh, you kind of need a kitchen in your house. And, yeah, but a kitchen is like kind of one of those essential things. I'm not sure if we can like really claim that we came up with it. But I talked about it first. Well, I built it first. And I was planning on building mine after I built my training course. You only started planning it after we started talking about it. And wait, oh, wait, wait, speaker, and what did you say? Training course? Just don't worry about it. Wait, that's suspicious. What are you doing? Uh, nothing. Uh, don't worry about it, guys. I I'll show you later. And, wait, 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 training course for what? Are you making a training course for your kid? Uh, no, 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 no. Just don't worry about it, like I said. <gasps> His baby's gonna get buff. And wait, are you making a gym for your kid? Oh, hold on, okay, that actually sounds like a pretty good idea. I should probably do that as well. Oh my gosh, you guys know 
nothing about what babies want. Yes, I do. I literally have you as my kid. And oh yeah, right. Speaker Man has experience having a kid. Oh gosh, well I gotta step up my game. He probably has like a, a tactics that he uses. Yeah, this challenge is gonna be super simple for me. Uh, I've already had experience with this challenge, and I've had Speaker Baby for like a year now. You have not been doing good with it, if I can be honest. And uh, whoa. I've been doing great with it. Yeah, I don't know about that. Just because I don't let you eat cake and candy every morning for breakfast doesn't mean I'm a bad parent. Yeah, it means you're the worst one. What? I'm doing a great job. It's a miracle you're still alive today. If I let you eat all those cookies and cake, you'd be like 800 pounds. And yeah, uh, Speaker Baby, I'm not sure if I really uh, agree with your parenting techniques. I'm not sure if like giving uh, a baby all the cake he wants is a good idea. You're right, it's not a good idea. It's a great idea. Oh my gosh, he's still doing it. He's not listening to you guys at all. Yeah, I still don't think that's a good idea, but I guess we'll see, uh, the, you know, once we like check out each other's houses. But anyways, guys, my go-kart track is coming along so well. This thing is actually looking sick so far, but I'm not sure how I'm gonna end it. Right now, I've kind of just got like a big spiral thing going up into the sky above my base. Wait, why don't you have a drop? Wait a minute, a drop? Okay, actually, that sounds like a really good idea, but hmm, where am I gonna make it drop in? Oh, wait, I guess I can just have a drop over here on this side of the house. Um, okay, here, let me go ahead and extend whoa, the go-kart track. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What happened? Guys, I just made the best dirt bike ever. And wait, wait, what? Can I see? I wanna see. Uh, yeah, here, let's just meet over on Dash's base, and I'll show you guys this is actually awesome. And it goes so fast! What? The wild my base! Because uh, you actually have the go-kart track? And, oh, okay, fair enough. But I haven't tested it before, so uh, I'm not sure if it's good. But here, put down the dirt bike. What do you mean the best dirt bike you've ever made? Aren't they all, like, the same? Get these stupid go-karts out of here. And hey, wait, why'd you break my go-karts? Uh, because I have something way better. Check this out. Look, it has a diamond engine over here. And, whoa, what the? A diamond whoa. engine? Yeah, and look at how fast I go. Whee! Hey, he just fell off. And, oh, uh, Speaker Man, I don't think you're very good at driving. Yeah, I think you go too fast to control it. Uh, I think you're not too good at uh, building, you know, like a track. Wait, Dash, is this your track? It's so awesome. And, oh, yeah, this is my go-kart track, but it's not done yet. I still need to add, like, a whole reinforced glass barrier around the entire thing so that if anyone, like, you know, accidentally hits the side, they won't fall off. Yeah, I was about to say, it would be so easy for your baby to just fall off right here. And, yeah, I cannot risk anything. I do not want my baby getting hurt. Yeah, and wait, I might be able to upgrade your go-karts. And, wait, what, you can't? What is that? Uh, this is a workshop, and you can upgrade pretty much everything about a car. And whoa, wait, is that a diamond engine I just saw in your hand? Yes, it is. And let me see. What wheels do I want? Uh, the sports, racing, up uh, racing 100%. Wait, remember, this is for a baby. Isn't this going to be too fast? And uh, yeah, Speaker Man, are you sure this is going to be fine? Well, they're going to learn at some point. Come on, guys. Um, Maybe when they're 16, but they're babies. And uh, yeah, I'm not sure if babies can like even like have a normal driver's license yet. And wait, hold on. I think I just picked it up. Go-kart. Is this the one that you just made? Uh, yeah, it is. Place it down. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. And, uh, okay, okay. Here, let me go ahead and put it down. And ew, it's red. And whoa, okay. That is a diamond engine right over there. Wait, how fast is it? Whoa! Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. I want to go ahead and take this for a spin. Here, let me put down another one and hop on. And here we go. And whoa, what the? Okay, that thing is very fast. What the? Wait, I wonder how fast the regular go-karts are compared to it. And oh my gosh, I'm so slow compared to the old one. And wait, wait, hold on. Come down over here. We should do a race underneath my house. Oh, yeah, let me jump down real quick. And, oh wait, my car's going to be slower now because I took damage. And wait here, let's go ahead and line up over here. And the first one to get over to Speaker Baby's cake wins. All right, sure. All right, all right. Are you guys ready? And yeah, yeah, ready? yeah, I'm ready. Set, go! And all right, go, 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 go! And okay, yeah, I think this diamond go-kart is way faster. Whoa, you just left me in the dust! Wow, that was so cool, Dash! That's a good thing you didn't crash through my cake, though. Otherwise, I would have been upset. And oh, yeah, we kind of rammed into your cake there. But okay, you know what? Honestly, I think I'm going to go ahead and use these diamond engine go-karts. They are pretty fast. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and replace all of these bad ones over here with some of these diamond ones. Although, I'm going to have to change their color later. I need to grab some spray paint. Oh, here, don't worry. I can just upgrade them right now. And, there I, you wait, go. Wait, 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 no, 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 no. I meant to change them to purple, not to orange. What in the world is this? Why would you change them to purple? Okay, well, just get out of my house, okay? Okay, well, here, let me just do that, and there we go, bye. And, oh my gosh, what in the world? And, hey, Speaker what are you still doing here? Uh, don't worry about it, uh, just give me one second, hold on, I'm almost done, uh, uh, uh. Uh, okay. All right, I'm ready, and I'm gone now. Let me just wait for this, and, all right, time to go. And, uh, th what in the world is that? <laughs> Stop driving into the Whee! walls, and, oh my god. Okay, well, then you go back to your house. I, I still gotta finish my go-kart track, but anyway, the next thing I have to do is go ahead and make this epic drop, and here, let me go ahead and make the track go all the way this way on this side of my house. Okay, while you guys are doing that, I'm going to build a computer room so my baby can watch Minecraft. And wait, what? You're building a computer room? Uh, yeah, doesn't that seem bad? Like, don't you want them away from computers? No way. Kids love staying inside all day. Uh, that doesn't sound very healthy, though. Shouldn't they, like, you know, be
be touching some grass? Yeah, when I was a kid, I loved going outside. It was so much fun. Grass smash. Everyone wants to watch YouTube. Okay, okay. I guess that's an interesting parenting technique. But anyways, my go-kart track drop is almost complete. I just need to go ahead and put down some water over here at the bottom because I do not want anybody getting hurt. So let me just put down some water like that. Boom. And then let me also go ahead and grab some pressure plates. And I can just go ahead and put those over here on this side. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just finishing up that drop that you suggested. I just got to go ahead and make the road go like this over here so that you can actually like park the cars once you're done. And now since I've got these pressure plates here, I can just go ahead and extend the road right over here. Oh, I can see the drop from here. I want to try it out when it's done. And oh yeah, definitely. It's going to be super sick once it's done here. I just got to go ahead and make this whole track loop all the way back into the garage really quick. And then the track should be pretty much done. Can I come over? Can I come over? Almost, almost. It's almost done here. I just got to do a few more things and then you can come over. Okay. All right. All right. Well, anyways, all I have to do now is just go ahead and open up this wall over here just like that. Boom. And then let me go ahead and connect the tracks just like this. And there we go. Okay. Now the basic outline of my go-kart track is done. And before I go ahead and add all of this reinforced glass around it, I should probably go ahead and test it out. So here, let me hop into another one of these go-karts and here we go. Let's test this thing out. And oh, wait, I already fell off. I'm not the best driver, I guess. I, I don't think the fast go-karts are the best for you. And yeah, maybe I should try a little bit of slower of a go-kart first. Let me go ahead and grab a normal one really quick and just place it down right over here. And all right, here we go. I'm gonna test it out with this normal one. Here we go. And Whoa, wait, the normal ones are also pretty fast. Yeah, but they're not as fast. Wait, I can see you on the track. That looks so fun. And whoa, wait, here I go. This thing actually is super fun here. I'm about to hit the drop. Let's go. And perfect landing. I landed into the water. And now I can just go ahead and loop right around this way. And boom, there we go. The track is all functional. That is so sick. Now I need to go ahead and add this reinforced glass. Yeah, well, I'm sorry to tell you, but my go-kart track is almost done. And it's already way better than yours. And wait, 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 wait. You built a go-kart track as well. There is no way it's better than mine. I spent so much time on this thing. And you said you like just built it? What? Yeah, and it's almost better than yours. I just got to finish building it and I'm almost done as well. No way it's going to be better than mine. You know what? Hold on. I'm coming to take a look at this right now. Uh, no, no, no. You can't come take a look. And, oh my gosh. Why are you being so secretive about your base? Uh, because I'm making something super awesome and I don't want you to steal it. Of course. <sighs> okay. Well, I'm just going to go ahead and finish putting all of the glass around my go-kart track. This is going to make the go-kart track super safe so that my baby doesn't get injured. And there we go. The first floor of my cake factory is almost complete. Cake factory? You're making a factory in your house? And wait, 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 what? Yeah, we need some way to supply food, don't we? Yeah, but what about a garden or something? Or like a farm? A factory? Yeah, a garden sounds a lot healthier than a cake factory. I'm not sure if a cake factory is really uh, healthy. Well, there is a garden to supply the wheat. Yeah, but like, what about a garden for like, you know, like carrots and potatoes and, you know, like healthy Ew, food? Oh, don't even talk about those. And okay, you have a very interesting uh, diet choice, but speaking about a garden, that's actually a really good idea. I'm probably gonna build one soon because, uh, you know, food is definitely going to be an important thing. Oh, yeah. Let me just place this here and then, oh, yeah, the lava in front of it. This is going to be awesome. And, wait, 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 Lava? You're putting lava in a house for your kid? Uh, that doesn't sound very safe, does it? I, well, it is very safe. It's for practice. Yeah, practicing. Practicing? Practicing what? Uh, uh, getting better? Yeah. Wait, what are you practicing with lava? What? Uh, that's a lot of stuff to answer. Uh, just don't worry about it. Okay, well, I'm curious to see what your house is gonna look like once we like check out everyone's houses but anyways my go-kart track is coming along so well this glass is gonna take a while to place though but it's gonna be all worth it well my house is gonna be the prettiest one uh, and my house is gonna be the best one for you know actually uh surviving and mine is gonna be both the best for surviving and the nicest looking one so uh i think that's gonna put both of your houses to shame i don't know about that that's, that's kind of a stretch mine is obviously the best looking well mine's like most normal looking house you guys have like all these like colorful reinforced concretes mine is just made out of simple wood simple wood looks nice for you know like 40 year olds but uh for children colorful is awesome uh what no my child is gonna have good taste okay and, and you know wood looks good uh well you could say that but uh i know he's not gonna like it wait spearman why did you not build any of this stuff for me when i was growing up uh, because you're still growing up and you don't need any of this stuff uh clearly i do if i'm still growing up yeah but the stuff you need is not any of like the go-kart tracks or stuff like that you need like uh, like books and uh, and tutors and you know the keeping to go to ew. school. Ew, ew, don't ew, stop talking, so stop talking. And ew, okay, yeah, I'm gonna agree with Speaker Baby on that one. That is pretty disgusting. Well, I'm just bringing in the truth if you can handle it. Maybe Speaker Baby was right. Maybe you aren't a good dad. I am a great dad. I'm just looking out for his future, and that's what dads do. Okay, well, I mean, you're a pretty average dad. I'm obviously gonna be the better dad though, since you know I've literally got a go kart track, and you know uh, go kart tracks are sick. Uh, average? Uh, are we forgetting that I'm the only one here? with 
with an actual sign? Well, technically, we all have actual kids now. I mean, uh, just take a look at the middle of the arena. Uh, you can see all of the kids, so I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, sure, if you want to think that, you can, but I'm the only one here with actual experience. Maybe not good experience, but I guess it's experience. Oh my gosh, even your old kid doesn't agree with you. Uh, he doesn't agree because I don't let him eat cake and candy every morning. I've told you guys this. Well, maybe I would agree if you did. And Okay, okay, guys, I think it's enough arguing. We gotta focus on building our houses because, again, I'm not sure how much time we have until the natural disasters. And here, I gotta finish up my go-kart track. This glass is taking so long. Wait, when is the natural disaster gonna get here? I don't even have a roof yet. And Wait, you don't have a roof yet? Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Uh, well, you better get some uh, building your roof because uh, if there's a natural disaster, you're definitely gonna need a roof. Wait, I don't have a roof either. Uh, you guys are far behind. I already have a roof and I have a bunch of activities in here. You guys are, you know... Not good at this. What? No, 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 no. The only reason I don't have a roof yet is because uh, I'm going to build a second floor to my house, okay? Then I'll put the roof on top of that one, okay? Uh, this was all planned. I had this all part of the plan. Yeah, sure it was. I think you're just making up excuses. I mean, he does have a point. Hey, I'm taking my time making my house look as beautiful as it can. You guys are just doing stuff like arcades and go-karts. I'm actually building stuff that we need to live. Well, building the prettiest house is not a factor. It's about surviving, and I'm already on my second training room for my son. <laughs> Wait, what the, What even are these training rooms? Do you have, like, a, like a a gym or something? Oh, yeah, I do have a gym, but uh, I have something way better I'm gonna have to show you later. I cannot believe how little you know about what babies want. I, I know exactly what they need. Yeah, but did you hear what I said? I said want, not need. Well, what do babies want besides desserts and cake anyway? They want toys and fun things. And wait, is a go-kart considered a toy or a fun thing? Obviously. Let's go! I'm gonna win! No, you're not, because I already have a go-kart track built, and boom, there we go, just finished it. And wait, what? Well, there's no way your go-kart track is better than mine. I spent so much more time on mine. Uh, my thing is actually the safest, most epic go-kart track you'll ever see. Uh, no, mine's the safest because it's actually inside my house. It doesn't matter if it's inside or outside. As long as I've got all of this reinforced glass, my thing is just as safe as yours. Uh, I don't think so. Well, I'm building my roof now. Oh, finally. You're finally catching up. And wait, speaking about catching up, I am almost done my go-kart track. Now, all I need to do is just do a few commands to finish up this last few parts with the glass. There we go. Boom. And now I need to go ahead and open up this hole so that we can have access to the drop again. There we go. And Okay, perfect. My go-kart track is almost done. This thing is looking so sick. I cannot wait to test this thing out once it's all fully complete. Tell me when it's done. I want to test it out and see if it's better than Speaker Man. Oh, it will be better than Speaker Man. Just give me one second. I just need to finish putting this last few pieces of glass over here, and then it should be fully complete. You haven't even seen mine, so how would you know if it's better or not? Well, Dash has been working on his since the beginning, so it has to be better. Yeah, just because he's spending a lot of time on it doesn't mean that it's better. Uh, well, the more time you put in something, the better it's going to be, obviously. Uh, yeah, not whenever you're doing it. What? Okay, well, here, I'm going to prove you wrong. As soon as you see my go-kart track, when it's all complete with all this glass, your mind is going to be changed. And whenever you see my go-kart track that's a thousand times better than yours, you're just going to cry. Okay, okay, we'll see about that. But anyways, here, my go-kart track is almost complete. I just need to place like 10 more pieces of glass down, and then it should be all fully done. Let me just use commands. And boom, there we go. My go-kart track is fully complete. Let's go. This thing is so sick. Wait, I want to try it. I want to try it. And okay, yeah, here, now that it's done, you can actually try it. So here, uh, I guess just follow me over here into the garage and... And uh, pick any go-kart. Wait, we should race. Okay, I'm gonna choose this one. Wait, wait, wait. I want to see how bad this racetrack is, so I'm on my way. And, well, it's not bad, okay? Uh, as soon as you come here, your mind is gonna be changed. Wait, Speaker Baby, you should come as well so that we can all have a race. All right, if you guys want to lose that bad, I guess I'll go. And, uh, dude, you're not winning it. Oh, hi, Speaker Man. Uh, pick a go-kart. Uh, yeah, hold on. Let me just... Uh, I want to pick uh, this one right here. And, and what? Dude, did you really bring your own go-kart? Just do that. This, let me do this, and let me get a crafting table. Hey, bringing your own cart is cheating. I know, I just need to do that, and there we go. And what? Okay, well, uh, is everyone ready? Uh, yeah, I'm ready to win. Okay. All right, all right, and anyways, everyone ready? On your marks, get set, go! Woo! And all right, all right, here we go. I'm in the lead. Whoa, wait, these go-karts are so fast. Okay, come on, come on here. I'm still in the lead, I think. And oh gosh, oh gosh, I kind of got stuck. Come on, here we go. I'm at the drop. Wait, you just got to the drop? I'm way ahead of you, and I'm back in the garage. I won, what, just like I said. Of me? Wait, wait, I'm here, I'm here. Hey, hold on. You guys just completed your first lap. I'm already on my third. And uh, what, Speaker Man? It was a one-lap race. Uh, yeah, and I already beat you guys. Uh, no, I clearly beat all of you. You guys are so slow. Okay, okay, whatever. And wait, hold on. Actually, this gives me an idea. Why don't I go ahead and grab some pressure plates and just go ahead and put those right over here like that. And here, let me just quickly go underneath all of these pressure plates and go ahead and place down this command block over here. Wait, what does it do? And oh, great question. Pretty much now, whenever someone crosses the finish line, it's gonna say someone has won so that uh, 
we know uh, when the first person has crossed the finish line. Wait, that's so cool. Oh, now all you guys can see that I won. Uh, here, let's get back on the cards and go for another round. And Okay, okay, except uh, you're not going to win. And Hey, Lionel, you can't get ahead on the track like that. I'm just turning around. I'm sorry that your course is so small. Guys, I'm obviously going to win again. I don't know why you're arguing. No, I'm going to win. All right, well, I'm doing the countdown now. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Hey, 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 sir. Okay, it's fine. I'm still going to win. Here we go. We should disqualify Speaker Man for going ahead first. Yeah, and, yeah honestly, we should. And I won. And wait, Speaker Man, he won? I'm in second place. Cart broke. What the heck? And <laughs> wait, Speaker Man, did your cart break down? And <laughs> I guess that's what you get for getting a red cart. You know, I, I guess red is just the worst color. Yeah, clearly orange is the best if I won twice. <laughs> uh, you know what? I'm just going to win this race with something better. Wait, is that a shopping cart? What in the world? Yes, it is. And I'm going to win this race. <laughs> Woo! You're so slow. I'm going again. You realize you came in last place, right? Uh, no, I was in first and my cart broke down because of Dash's stupid drop. It was not because of my drop. I had water at the bottom. It was all your fault. But anyways, guys, get out of my house. I still need to finish my stuff, all right? You guys need to go work on your own house. And I've got to work on my house. So, hmm, what should I build next? All right, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. And uh, the light in the way. Hey, stop driving that shopping cart in my house. I right, get out. Open the door. And the what? No, dude, just get out of the shopping cart. Fine, but uh, you break my shopping cart one more time and it's gone for your house. And, uh, dude, stay away from my house. Okay, I gotta start working on more stuff. Um, all right. Well, anyways, what should I build next? I think the first thing I should probably do is make all of these go karts like you know an actual good color. So let me go ahead and grab some spray paint and some purple dye really quick. And here, let me go ahead and make them all look super nice. There we go. And wait, hold on. I actually need to go ahead and put these all in the correct position. They all got moved around. So let me just pick them up and put them down like that. Let me flip this one because it's facing the wrong way. There we go. That looks pretty good and nice. There we go. All the go karts are fully lined up. Alrighty, I'm going to put this down right here. Oh, that looks so good. I'm going to do a movie room. And, whoa, wait, like a movie room? Okay, that's actually a pretty good idea, but... Hmm, what should I build next? And wait a minute, what about a pool? Uh, wait, have any of you guys built a pool yet? Uh, no, I'm not gonna do that because it's stupid. What? How is a pool stupid? And yeah, wait, what? The pools are awesome. Yeah, a pool's gonna be awesome in the middle of a tornado. That'll just turn into a hurricane then. Uh, no, it's not gonna be bad. I can just go ahead and cover it up with more reinforced glass so that if anything goes wrong, you know, the reinforced glass will protect it. Can your baby even swim? Did you teach it to swim? And wait, that's actually a pretty good point. Hold on, I need to test that out. Uh, baby Dash, uh, let me go ahead and grab some water really quick. I need to put him through a little swimming Test. Wait, you're putting your baby through a swimming test? Uh, yeah. How else is he going to learn how to swim? Here, let me go ahead and make a little temporary pool right over there. And all right, here, uh, baby Dash, uh, try swimming through this. And, oh, wait, check it out. Look, he already knows how to swim. I don't even have to teach him anything. Well, I guess babies are smarter than I thought, huh? I don't know about that. I'm pretty sure I'm just really smart. So, like, my genes transferred down to my baby. I don't think that's how that works. At least you don't have to teach him the way that Speaker Man taught me. How did Speaker Man teach you how to swim? Oh, he just threw me in the ocean and left me there. <laughs> and, uh, wait, what? Uh, Speaker Man, did you really do that? I did not. I gave him a bath. Your definition of a bath is very different from mine. And, uh, wait, Speaker Man, that's pretty messed up. You just left him in the ocean. Yeah, I can't believe you did that. No, I didn't. I gave him a bath and gave him a rubber ducky. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, okay, I don't know who to believe right now. Probably the adult. Dash, don't believe him. There was a bunch of fish and sharks. And, oh, gosh, yeah, that does sound pretty terrifying. I don't know who to believe. They were not real fish and sharks. I don't know. I think I feel bad for Speaker Baby. And Yeah, I don't know. That sounds like quite a traumatizing experience. But anyways, here, I need to go ahead and finish up my pool area. Let me just put these blocks here. And then I can go ahead and put a door over here inside of my house to, like, actually get into the pool. And boom, there we go. My pool area is complete. This looks sick. Although, I should probably, like, uh, fix this grass over here. I don't want to just have grass around my pool. And wait a minute, hold on. I actually just got an even better idea. What about instead of just having a normal pool, I can also build a water slide. So here, let me go ahead and start doing that now. A water slide? Where are you going to put your water slide? Oh, well, I'm just going to put it inside of the pool, of course, here. I just got to build a little staircase so that my baby can actually get up on it just like this. And wait, hold on, let me fill this up with water. And um, okay, this should be about tall enough. Yeah, that looks good. Now I need to build the actual slide. See, Dash, now you're doing it right. Yeah, let's go. This water slide is going to be so epic. Here, I'm just going to make it go all the way down into the pool. It's gonna be so sick. Let me just go ahead and make the water slide turn just like that. And boom, there we go. The water slide is going inside of the pool. This sick. Here, let me go ahead and make some walls over here so that I can actually like put some water on it. All right, well, while you're building a water park, I'm actually, you know, like training my son to uh, be the best ever. Well, a water park is definitely gonna help my son train to be like the best ever, you know? Uh, he has to learn how to swim, right? Yeah, but like that's all that he's gonna learn how to do in a water park. How is he gonna learn how to fight for himself? And, wait, actually, that's not all he's gonna learn how to do in a water park. He's also gonna learn how to ride a jet ski. Let's go! What, a jet ski? I wouldn't let a baby touch one of those. I don't 
know. I think jet skis are pretty cool. And yeah, the speaker man, it's gonna be fine. You know, it's just like in a small enclosed area. Nothing could go wrong. Uh, whenever you say nothing can go wrong, it always can go wrong and will go wrong. I, I, no, I think you're wrong. That's not how it works. But anyways, now that I've got all these like cool activities done, I need to build the second floor of my house. And wait, I need to build like the actual bedroom for my baby. Like I, he's gonna need a place to sleep. Oh yeah, I completely forgot that I need to make a bedroom. Oh wait, I have to do that too. And yeah, guys, a bedroom is uh, like kind of super important. We need a place for our babies to sleep like while they're not awake. Wait, you're so right because when they're not awake, they're sleeping. What? Did you just say? I am so confused right now. Well, when they're not awake, they need a place to sleep. Uh, I don't know what's so confusing about that. Maybe, you know, say it better. How else am I supposed to say it? That's like the most simplest explanation I can think of. Yeah, don't be so judgmental. Well, all you need to say is they just need a place to sleep like a bedroom. Boom. Yeah, but that's not giving enough details. Like, what if they're trying to sleep, but they are awake, okay? I need to build a room for, like, when they're sleeping and they're not awake. What? I'm so confused. Yeah, Speaker Man, I don't know why you're confused. This is perfectly clear. I'm with Dash on this one. I'm not the only one that's confused. Speaker Baby is also confused. Did you not hear him? Speaker Baby, are you confused? Well, there's nothing really to be confused about. I'm not even going to build a bedroom because I'm not going to sleep. And, oh, wait, what, what about for your baby? Is he going to need to get some sleep? Uh, no, we're going to stay up all night. We're going to be playing a bunch of games. Uh, I'm not sure if that's a good idea idea. Wait, that sounds really unhealthy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure sleep is kind of important, uh, you know. Sleep me, who cares? This is why you're so short, Spooky Baby. You didn't sleep enough and now you're so small. And Yeah, exactly. Sleep is a very important part in the growth process. No, it's just because I'm a year old. Who cares? I don't know. Sleep is pretty important. I'm going ahead and putting down some beds now. I'm going to go ahead and put down purple beds in every room and um, here, I guess I'll also go ahead and put down like some tables so that, you know, my baby can have room to, I don't know, put stuff on his table. Why do you always talk so confusingly? I don't talk confusingly. Of course, he's gonna need uh, tables and uh, like to put stuff on. But anyways, now let me go ahead and put some lights in this room just to make it look super sick, just like that. And let me also go ahead and put on some windows just like for an additional nice view so he can check out what the outside is like. And then I can just go ahead and do the exact same thing over here for my bedroom. And I'm just literally just gonna do the exact same thing. Let me put down all of these wood slabs just like that. Let me go ahead and put down the lantern just like this. And here, let me put down the reinforced glass. And <gasps> wait a minute, I just got a really good idea. Uh, guys, what? What if I go ahead and put a camera inside of my baby's room? That way, if he ever needs help or anything, he can just tell me through the camera. Oh, yeah, I, I've already done that. There is no way you already did that. That was like the most original idea I've ever had in my life. Uh, well, I kind of done it by accident. How do you set up a camera monitor in your baby's room by accident? Whoa, wait, I'm looking through mine right now. Okay, this is going to be perfect. Uh, Speaker Man, how come I never got one of those, but this baby does? Uh, this baby is kind of, you know, more important. Wow, you did not just say that. And, whoa. Whoa, I'm so sorry, Speaker Baby. He's such an awful dad. I'm sorry, too, because his base is about to blow up. I'm going over there with TNT right and, now. Uh, wait, 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 what? Uh, my base is explosion proof, so that wouldn't even work. Oh, really? Do you want to try that out? Uh, sure, why not? Uh, wait, guys, I'm not sure if this is the best idea. Uh, you know, there's already natural disaster. Except, hey, what are you doing? Oh, wait, you're actually lighting it. Uh, I better get out of here. Yeah, we're testing it out. And there we go. Okay, but it's not speaker baby proof. I'm going to start breaking it. Hey, stop it. If you don't stop now, I'm putting you on a healthy diet. I'm already on one. You don't give me any cookies or cake anyways. No more sugar for you. Only broccoli and apples. That's all you feed me. Uh, I think we should should leave them alone, Dash. They seem like they're doing their own thing. And yeah, that sounds like a good idea. I'm gonna get back to building my house. I gotta build my kitchen area next because my baby's gonna need to eat food somehow. So here, let me go ahead and put down a slab right over here. And let me also go ahead and grab some quartz blocks and some water and a lever really quick because uh, this is everything I need to build a sink. And now let me go ahead and put this all down over here and there we go. My sink is complete. And hmm, what else does a kitchen usually have? Well, mine has a cabinet and it's got flowers and a stove and a refrigerator. Oh, yeah, right. Uh, all those things. Okay, uh, I guess I'll build the refrigerator first. Let me go ahead and grab some dispensers. These could be my refrigerators for now. And let me just put them like that. And then I can put a lever over here. And wait, actually, I think I need to put a full block down here and then a lever over here. And I'm pretty sure whenever I flick this lever, items should come out of both of the dispensers. And okay, yeah, perfect. And hmm, I guess on the top dispenser, I can go ahead and put some healthy stuff like carrots and some steak and uh yeah that's like the only healthy things i know Ew. what do you mean that's gonna be the good stuff no that is not the good stuff okay and then in the bottom i can go ahead and put like a treat that's kind of unhealthy but hmm, what can i put that's unhealthy obviously you should put some cake your baby will love that hmm, an entire cake i'm not sure about all that oh what about some beetroot those are pretty healthy you actually want me to vomit don't you yeah not i'm not even that bad uh okay i guess no beetroots but whoa what about a black hole carrot it's like a blue carrot this this thing looks pretty crazy. Wait, I've never heard of that before. 
What is that? I have no idea, but hopefully it tastes good. But anyways, now whenever I flick my lever, my baby's gonna get a steak and uh, one of these black hole carrots. You should have put cookies and cake and not a weird carrot. I'm not gonna put cookies and cake anywhere in my house. But anyways, I guess the next thing I need to put are some like cabinets. So let me go ahead and put those down over here up at the top, just like this. This looks pretty good. And anyways, my kitchen is complete. But anyways, guys, I'm not sure how much time we have until the natural disaster. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring my baby up into my house because I don't want him just waiting out there. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I have to finish my roof still and then I'll move my baby in. And oh yeah, it looks like you still have a lot of work to do with your roof up here. Let me bring my baby here. I gotta build like a staircase or something for him to get out. My baby's gonna have to earn his way to his bedroom. You'll see. And, oh, uh, I'm curious what that means, but okay, here, let me go ahead and make a little staircase for my baby. Come on, we gotta go quick. All right, all right, and here, let me just keep building this staircase and uh, wait, uh, baby Dash, why aren't you following me? Come on. Uh, baby, uh, those are got, yeah. Did it. And, uh, wait, so what, what did you just say to your baby? Is he following you? Uh, yeah, can you not speak baby? Uh, no, I can't speak baby. What in the world? Okay, uh, wait, can you tell my baby to follow me? I can try, but I might not speak Dash language. Wait, what, there's different languages for different babies? Uh, okay, I guess give it a try. Baby Dash, girl up, follow, follow. Uh, wait, did, did it work? Uh, no, he just insulted me. Uh, he see, what's up? And, uh, wait, 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 speaker, what are you doing? He insulted me. I, I'm sorry, I, I guess I won't help you. What in the world? Oh my gosh, uh, baby Dash, okay, uh, you have to be nicer to strangers, but okay, just follow me up this staircase, okay? Okay, we gotta get to the house. And oh, wait, there we go. Now he's following me. Oh, I guess you learned how to speak his language. Uh, I don't know. He kind of just started following me. But anyways, here, I gotta bring him up to my base really quick. Come on. Once we have our babies in our bases, we should have a tour of each other's houses. And yeah, we should definitely do that. I really want to see what you guys built. But here, let me just finish up this staircase really quick. And here, come on, come on. Just follow me right this way, baby Dash. Come on here. You can enter through the door just like this. Come on. And boom, there we go. My baby is inside of my house. Uh, you guys want to do the tours now? Uh, Sure, I guess. Alrighty, and boom, my roof is done. Everyone come here. Let's tour my house first because it's probably going to be the best. And Oh, uh, I guess we're going to check out your house first, but uh, mine is definitely the best. I don't know about that. Mine is clearly the best. Uh, no, mine's definitely the best, and we'll save that one for last because, you know, uh, last is always the best. Oh, okay, okay. Well, anyways, uh, where do we get started, Ruby? Okay, so this is my foundation, and I lifted it so that if it floods, it's going to be okay. We go up here. And Oh, wait, that's actually a pretty good idea, but wait, where's our baby? And we open up this fence so the baby can't go outside and close it, close it, close it, close it. I don't want her to get out. Uh, okay. Well, wait, where are they? Oh, baby Ruby, are you here? Where are you? There she is. Hi, everyone. Who are these guys? Oh, well, I'm Speaker Man, and uh, yeah, I'm the best builder here. And, uh, what? No, he is not the best builder. He's lying. I'm Dash. I'm uh, the best builder here. Uh, no, I'm Speaker Man, and I'm the best builder here. Uh, no, I'm Speaker Baby, and I'm the best builder here, clearly. Ew. <laughs> Why is Speaker Baby wearing a diaper? Because uh, he is a baby, and so are you. Yeah, but I don't need diapers. <laughs> Speaker baby pooped his pants. <laughs> uh, what? You're literally wearing one too. Can you not see? Um, I don't know what you're talking about. Well, anyways, let's let baby Ruby see the house. It's her first time here. Yeah, I want to see the house. I want to see the house. Oh, well, first you got to open the door so we can start this tour. But uh, where exactly do we start in this tour? Well, we can just start out here. So we have a little mine cart thing so she can play around in it. And wait, why did she just drop a bunch of poppies? Baby Ruby, were you eating flowers again? No, <laughs> I wasn't eating flowers. Wait, and wait, what? She eats flowers? Uh, what? Your your child? Child eats flowers? She just really likes vegetables, okay? You were trying to say that I'm unhealthy. Okay, well, uh, what's the first part of the tour? Flowers are not vegetables. So, this is our living room, and after that, we have our movie room right here. You open up the curtains, and you go inside, and there's a big screen right there for you. Oh, wait, a movie room? Oh, what are we watching? And, whoa, wait, I'm not gonna lie. This movie room is actually pretty cool. Uh, this is boring. I don't like this movie room. Uh, wait, I don't think your baby likes this area very much. Baby Ruby, don't break the glass. Come back. Oh, wait, uh, I think your baby... Baby's misbehaving. No, she's perfect. She's a little angel. Come here. I don't want you. Uh, yeah, I don't think she's an angel. I think she's, uh, you know, throwing a tantrum right now. And, uh, yeah, she doesn't look very happy. Come here. Do you need a nap? You seem cranky. So this is our bedroom. We have a carpet so it's soft so she can roll around. And then we have a crafting room right here. Wait, your bedroom's in the middle of the open? What the heck? Well, so she can nap whenever she wants. I don't like this bed. Burn, baby, burn! And, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Is she burning the bed? Um, I don't think she really likes the bed you made. Um, um, I think she, I think she's just a little tired. That's all. This house is lame. Uh, lame. Uh, wait, she's already burning like the entire house. Uh, I'm not sure if she really likes the entire house at all. Um, um, I think she just needs a snack. Stop setting things on fire. 
fire, please. Come here. Uh, oh, what the heck? Uh, get her under control. Okay, let's just go to the kitchen. Come on, guys. Uh, okay, yeah, I guess we can check out the kitchen. Uh, maybe you should feed her something. Maybe she's hungry. You've got vending machines in your house? Yeah, I don't want her to get thirsty, so we've got water and soda and energy drink. Wait, I want orange juice. Give me orange juice now. And, uh, wait, I don't think she likes the vending machines either. She doesn't like, like anything in this house. Ruby Juniors, don't do that. There was no orange juice. I'm so angry. Uh, I think she wants some orange juice. Um, I don't have any orange juice, but, um, you want a cookie? You want a cookie? No, I don't want a cookie. And, wow, okay, it seems like she really does not like anything here. I don't know what to That's do. That's the weirdest baby I've ever seen turning down cookies. All right, well, while you're trying to get your baby under control, I think we should move on with the next tours, and, uh, who should we go next? Uh, what about Dash? And, oh, yeah, I guess we can go to my house. Uh, I, hopefully my baby is gonna be better than, uh, baby Ruby. Baby Ruby, just stay in the kitchen. Come on, over here. Hey, just go into the kitchen and stay there. Wait, I don't want to be in the kitchen. Okay, I think it's all good now. And wait, you're just going to leave her in the kitchen? Uh, okay, I guess that works. Yeah, here, let's go on to the next tour. Yeah, hopefully your baby is well behaved uh, on like Ruby's baby. Hey, maybe she's just tired and needs a nappy wappy, you know? All right, well, anyways, everyone, here is my house right over here. It is a sky base because, you know, this is probably the most safe type of base. You know, it can survive against floods, lava volcanoes, and uh, meteors, all that stuff. Wait, that's pretty smart. I don't know about meteors. And yeah, and what if it like, you know, starts like raining fire? When is it ever going to rain fire? Can't that happen after a volcano? Uh, I don't think that's a thing. All right. Well, anyways, here is my house right over here. What do you guys think? Uh, I think it is very ugly. Right, it's not that ugly. It looks quaint. Oh, your house matches your face. It's ugly. But what, dude? My face is not ugly. But anyways, the only way that we can enter the house is if I actually look at this scanner door over here, and then it opens up, boom, just like that. Oh, so you have to be ugly to get inside. And, no, dude, you don't. And anyways, oh, hi there, Dash Baby. Oh, hello, Dad. Uh, wait, who are these people? Oh, uh, well, Dash Baby, this is Speaker Man. This is Ruby, and oh, this Speaker Baby. You might know him. Oh, yeah, do you not remember me from when we argued earlier? Oh, wait, it's you again. Get out of here. Oh, yeah, that's it. Get over here. And, hey, wait, guys, 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 stop fighting. Stop fighting. Okay, come on, let's just have this house tour, and then you guys can settle your differences afterwards. And yeah, Dad, here, let's get this thing started. I don't want to be with this speaker baby guy any longer. And okay, okay, yeah, here, we can get started. But anyways, guys, the first room that I've got is the arcade room right over here. This is where we can play arcade games and stuff. What do you think, Dash Baby? Oh, wait, an arcade room. This is actually pretty cool. Wait, what game is this? I made it straight for Tetris! And, uh, wait, what's Tetris? <gasps> wait, you don't know what Tetris is? Uh, find one of the arcade games that have Tetris and play it. It's so much fun. Uh, okay, here, I guess I'll play this one over here. Here. And oh, but well, you're playing Tetris? Okay, hold on. Let me find an arcade machine with Tetris as well. It's pretty fun. Pretty much, you have to try to build the tallest tower. That is not how you play Tetris, Dash. Yeah, I think Speaker Baby is right. I don't think that's how you play. And no, 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 guys, trust me. That's how you play. I'm like a world uh, expert at uh, Tetris. Uh, here, Dash Baby, uh, just try to get the tallest tower. Uh, okay, Dad, I'm trying to get the tallest tower. Okay, nice, that's nice. Here, same here. We're gonna have the tallest towers ever. Uh, guys, you're supposed to keep the shortest tower. Uh, what? No, my dad says you're supposed to build the tallest tower, so that's what I'm doing. Uh, no, your dad is wrong. And uh, no, Speaker Baby. You're supposed to build the tallest tower here. I'm almost done with my tower. And boom, there we go. And uh, wait, Dad, I just built the tallest tower and it said I lost. I hate all these games. I'm breaking all these machines. And uh, wait, wait, no, Dash Baby, what are you doing? Come on. You can't just break all the machines if you lose once. Uh, no, I hate this entire room. I'm getting rid of all of these. Oh my gosh, what are you doing? Uh, see, I told you babies don't like arcades. Yeah, Dad, it said I lost. I don't like that. Maybe if you told him the actual rules to Tetris, he wouldn't be and, mad. Oh my gosh, okay, it's fine, fine, fine. Uh, let's just move on to the next room. Okay, yeah, what do you have next for me, Dad? Yeah, what about that zoo you were talking and, about. Oh, yeah, the petting zoo. Okay, this is probably, like, the best part. Uh, wait, Dad, what's that? Oh, uh, the baby Dash, that is a gorilla. That is your, uh, your pet, pretty much. Uh, he's really cool. You wanna go say hi to him? And, uh, yeah, of course. Those things look awesome here. I'm going into the petting zoo right now. And, oh, yeah, look, guys, he's having fun with the gorilla. I don't know. That looks pretty dangerous to me. Oh, no, gorilla on the loose, gorilla on the loose. Get back, baby Dash. And, uh, wait, what in the world is going on? Are you trying to shoot my gorilla? Uh, no, I just put him to sleep. Look, he's sleeping right now. Oh, why'd you do that, speaker, baby? I wanted to keep punching him. But, wait, there's still a small gorilla. I wanna try playing with this one. And wait, where is the small gorilla? Wait, did it escape? This is not a gorilla. This is just a monkey. And oh yeah, right. Monkey, not gorilla. Oh, wait, this monkey looks pretty nice. I want to hug him. <gasps> wait, uh, Dash Baby, I think you hugged him a little bit too hard. Oh, oh my God. Anyway, uh, but what, what's the next What's the next step of this tour? You guys are way too soft. Uh, uh, the, well, anyways, the next step of this tour is uh, I guess the go-kart track. Yeah, this is the best part of the entire house. Here, everyone hop into a go-kart. Alright, well, I'll get in this one. And, uh, hey, no, get out. That's my go-kart. Uh, what? Fine. Good. I want to sit next to my dad. Oh boy, I can't wait to win for the third time. And wait, Dash Baby, you gotta beat the speaker baby guy. He's been winning a lot recently. Oh yeah, no problem, Dad. This should be easy. There's no way that you guys are gonna beat me. I'm gonna get my third win. And, okay, we'll see about that. But anyways, here, everyone line up. Let's go in three, two, one, go! Uh, I'm going! Now I got
second. Wait, guys, I think I'm in the lead. This is no problem. Let's go. And there we go. I'm already at the drop. And I'm already at the finish line. Whoa, I won. Oh, come on. Uh, what? There's no way. Uh, but I did. That's it. Let's go. I didn't even see you at the drop speaker, man. I, I was there. I, I was just ahead of all of you. All right. All right. Well, it doesn't matter who won. You know, it was a pretty close race. But uh, wait, where's Dash Baby at? Dad, help, help. I'm stuck on the top of the track. Oh, no. Wait, what? Wait, he's stuck on the top of the track. Wait, everyone, come on. We have to go get him. What? I told you this wasn't safe. Dad, Dad, come help me. I scary up here. And wait, where is he? Hold on, hold on. I, come, wait, is that him right over there? How did you get up there? Oh, no, no. Come down here. Come down here. What are you doing up above the track? It looked funny. I wanted to go up there, but thanks for saving me. What in the world? Oh my gosh. Okay, don't go off the track. How, how did you even get up here? Don't worry about it. Well, I guess let's just look at the next part of the tour. This feels dangerous. And yeah, that sounds good. Right, well, I'll meet you guys down by the bottom. I just got to turn around and away I go. I, well, okay. That was pretty fast. All right. Well, here, everyone, follow me to the next part of the tour. All right. All right. Well, anyways, everyone, follow me right up this way. Dash Baby, this is your bedroom up here. I'm going to show it to you. It's right over here. What do you think? Uh, wait, are you serious? What is this? Uh, wait, what do you mean? This is your bedroom. It's pretty nice, right? We got the purple beds. We got the lanterns up here and then we got the tables for if you want to put stuff on the tables uh yeah yeah that's cool but that's not the problem though why are there purple beds uh wait what what do you mean yeah see even he agrees purple's the worst color a uh, red is such a better color uh, wait what did you say red is the best color Ew, the red is disgusting. And oh, there we go. Yeah, I mean, he's right about that. Red is a pretty disgusting color. Yeah, it's obviously orange. Orange is the best color. You know what I think about the color red? This is what I think about the color red. Oh! Come here. Oh! And, uh, wait, this is a flamethrower dash. Wait, where'd you get that from? Dash, what have you been teaching him? Uh, I didn't teach him anything. I don't know where he got that from. Hey, what are you doing? Get your son under control. Uh, I, I, dash, baby. Uh, yeah, you need to stop that right now. Come over here. Uh, um, I don't think he's listening to you. Uh, dash, baby, what are you doing? How do you have a flamethrower? Where do you even find that. Oh, don't worry about it. Someone gave it to me. Who gave it to you? Oh, uh, we had some exchanges. Uh, what? All right, now, where's the speaker man at? Uh, uh wait, speaker man, uh, did you hide? Where are you? Uh, yeah, I'm hiding. Uh, okay, good. Yeah, just stay hidden. I don't know why Dash Baby is up to this. Wait a minute. I smell speaker man. He's over here. I'm getting him. Whoa, whoa. Did he just sniff you out? What in the world? I can't get out of your stupid house because of the ugly detector. Oh, wait, they just closed the door. Dash Baby, stop. Oh, I ran out of gas. And, oh my gosh, thank goodness. Uh, okay, speaker man, you should be good now. He ran out of gas, but there's so much fire in my house now. And phew, oh my gosh, I had to run everywhere to outrun the fire, and I think I uh, gave myself a tour there. And oh yeah, I guess you guys already saw the next room, which is the water park area over here, but yeah, there's the water slide, and oh my gosh, it's literally on fire. What in the world? Wee, fire slide, yippee! And oh, uh, be careful over there, Dash Baby. Oh, that was so much fun. At least it's a better color. It's orange now. Ew, no, orange is disgusting. I'm gonna go break all this fire. And oh yeah, actually, uh, I guess that's a good thing. Yeah, thanks for breaking the fire. Oh my gosh, Dash. Does your kid like any colors? I like the color maroon. Uh, wait, what is maroon? Um, maroon is like a reddish brown, I think. Oh. Yeah, it's like what my base is made of. That's exactly what maroon is. All right, well, uh, anyways, I think you guys have already seen everything in my house. Uh, here, Dash Baby, uh, why don't you go up over here into your bedroom? And oh my gosh, there's so much fire up here. Hopefully it doesn't spread. But uh, yeah, uh, I think we should just move on with the next door. Oh my gosh, there's so much fire. And yeah, just stay in your bedroom. All right, but I'm changing these beds first. These things are disgusting. And oh, uh, okay, yeah, you do whatever. Let's just go on to the next tour. I think your kid was even crazier than mine. And yeah, I think so. He literally had a flamethrower. Right, well, anyway, I think my tour is next, right? And oh, yeah, I guess we can check out your house next. I'm so excited to see what you have inside because I have like no clue. Well, that means we're saving the best for last. So I'm going last. Uh, no, we're, uh, you know, best is third. So we're just going to do this one. That is not a saying. No one's ever said that ever. Uh, well, I just did. So get over it. Uh, okay, well, uh, let's get started. All right, well, speaker baby, are you ready for this awesome tour? Oh, yeah. And Wait, is that what your kid sounds like? Uh, yeah, and wait, uh, I, this is going to be hard to talk to two speaker babies at the same time. You could be speaker man baby, and you could be speaker baby. There we go. Uh, wait, why does he get the man title? Oh, he's gone through the training. Uh, You'll see. Speaker man. It's in the name. Um, well, this is a pretty interesting build. Yeah, wait, where do we start first? Well, uh, we'll start over here by the kitchen. Uh, It's... Just a normal kitchen. Where's the ovens? Uh, there's not really a need for ovens because all that's here is apples. You know what they say, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. What my pops told me. Uh, yeah. You gotta learn them well, but anyway, you guys should probably grab, like, a stack of each. Uh, you're gonna need it. Uh, yeah, gross. I'm not touching those. Uh, uh, wait, what, why do we need apples? Uh, you'll see. These apples look like they're poison. They're so gross. Oh, just eat one of them. They're so awesome. No, thanks. Very rich in vitamin C. And, uh, I think I'll save mine for later if I get hungry, but uh, anyways, what's the next part of the tour? Oh, wait, yeah, that reminds me. Let me just do this, and everyone needs to be in survival for this entire tour. And, uh, wait, why, why do we have to be in survival? 
Oh, this sounds like a trap. Oh, I'm ready for this part. Yeah, see, he's ready. Uh, but we'll start over here first. Uh, we'll do the fun stuff. Uh, here we have a bouncy castle, you know, for some fun if you just want to relax. And oh, yeah, a bouncy castle. That's pretty cool and uh, normal, I guess. This was specifically made for recreational purposes, specifically for exercise. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, and over here, uh, we have like a little maze to uh, help uh, understand, you know, pathfinding. You could just come over here and run through the entire maze, and there's a bunch of like obstacles you got to run through. It's pretty short. I don't think this is a maze. Yeah, it's mostly an obstacle course. Uh, I make Speaker Man Baby run it 100 times a day for training. And wait, what? 100 times a day? Doesn't it get tiring? I like the mental burn it gives my Cerebus Corso. Yeah, see, he's learned a lot from uh, doing this every day. Uh, but over here, guys, is where the real fun begins. Uh, just come over here and grab yourself a jetpack. A jetpack? Oh, yeah. Uh, wait, why do we need jetpacks? Oh, well, you need it for this awesome obstacle course for jetpacks where you've got to fly through the entire course and try not to get stuck or hit by obstacles. And, whoa, wait, hold on. This seems a little bit dangerous. So what happens if we hit the obstacles? Then you hit your head. You just got to get better. Seriously, just do better. Wait, this seems kind of dangerous. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. I got to be careful. I don't want to hit my head anywhere. Come on. And, okay, wait, did I make it? Yep, you made it. Oh, guys, I'm stuck. And, uh, wait, are you going through the cobwebs? What are you doing? Uh, is that not what you're supposed to do? No, there's holes on the side. I know I'm stuck. You're a bunch of amateurs. Let me show you how the pros get it done. I am not an amateur. I just messed up a little bit. See, I'm through. All right, well, now that you're all here, uh, this is where the real fun begins. And whoa, wait, you have a go-kart track as well? But wait, hold on. This doesn't look nearly as good as mine. My go-kart track is way better. Wait, yours has holes in it. Well, yeah, the track needs to have a challenge. Oh, yeah. Let's have a little bit of fun. Uh, okay, I guess I'm ready. This is so strange. All right, well, we'll go in three, two, one. Go, 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 go. All right, all right let's go. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I'm in the lead, but wait, how do we get up here? What? I have these flaming arrows. Speaker Man, you built your go-kart track completely wrong. What is this? <laughs> what? I thought it could go up blocks. Uh, no, it cannot go up blocks. Wait, why are there fire arrows here? Uh, it's an obstacle course. Uh, let's just, uh, you know, like, uh, grab our go-karts and go up here. Well, I guess that settles it. Dash's go-kart track is better. Yeah, this is terrible. Yeah, well, we have to lift up our go-karts to get up the stairs okay that is a pretty bad user experience but let's just keep going i like the weight of the go-kart as it increases my muscle size good for recreation why does that baby talk like that i have no idea uh, speaker man baby has a very interesting voice oh and this is the end to the go-kart track and uh you guys might want to get ready for this and uh wait oh, what's this part we're in survival again uh what is going on oh nothing you might just need what's in this chest and wait what's inside of this chest and oh armor uh i guess i'll go ahead and grab some of this and uh, wait, are those mutant zombies? Oh, gosh, oh, gosh! Wait, what's going on? Ah! I didn't even put on armor yet! Quick, 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 everyone put on your armor! We gotta get rid of these guys! Come on, come on! Oh, now I have to eat these disgusting apples! And oh, gosh, oh, gosh, I'm getting kind of low as well! See, this is why we needed the survival experience. This is what happens when you don't eat your apples. Apples are gross. I am not eating those things. Oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh, these things are so scary! Quick, take them all out! Hey, your apples, they make you super strong! And Okay, there we go. I think we just took out all of them. All right, and that's it! Oh, uh, yes. Nothing like a kicked butt in the morning. What in the world? Okay, well, what's the next part? Uh, the next part is the final part, and up here it is, and this is the bedroom. Why does the bedroom look like this? And Yeah, wait, this isn't a bedroom. This is like a, a bed platform. What? And why are there security cameras everywhere? We call this the master bedroom. This is just a room with beds. This is barely a bedroom. I let Speaker Man Baby design this. This is all his idea. I've crafted all these beds in a specific pattern so that way I can increase my growth. This is all made specifically for minimalistic design, only for function over fashion. Uh, okay, well, is that your entire tour? Yep, that's it. And I think I had the most normal baby out of all of us so far. Uh, I, that baby is not normal. I learned from the best. Yeah, see, guys, I told you, but anyway, uh, it's time for the final tour and the worst. Uh, let's go to see your house, Speaker Baby. It is not gonna be the worst tour the worst tour was this one i am honored that you came to visit our humble abode now i will take a deep nappy wappy good day to you all okay you have fun with that let's just go to speaker baby's house i'm glad i didn't grow up like that guy oh as soon as we get home i'm putting all these things in our house no you are not and i uh, okay well let's just get on with the next tour and whoa okay your house is literally a cake i'm curious to see what you have inside of here uh obviously the most essential things for surviving a natural disaster well show us the inside all right well here we go we just open up the doors and well here is my baby wait he's so small 
<laughs> yeah, wait, I didn't know that they made people smaller than you. I said not to make fun of Stuart, remember? Oh, fine, we'll stop making fun of him. But uh, where do we start with your tour? Well, how about this? I'll let you guys pick your room. We can either go right to the cake factory or left to the game room. And what, you really built a cake factory? Uh, I guess let's go to the game room first. Yeah, let's go to the fun area. Hey, cakes are fun, but over here we have a bunch of laptops where we can do our games or we have arcade machines. Okay, okay, this area looks pretty nice. There's a bunch of games to play like Pac-Man and Tetris. And unlike you, Dash, my baby actually knows how to play Tetris. And oh, wait, what? There is no way this guy knows how to play Tetris. I'm probably better than him. Uh, yeah, I totally know how to play Tetris. Oh, yeah? Well, how about we do a Tetris 1v1 here? Uh, I'll go in this machine over here and uh, you go in another all one. Right, I have this one right here. All right, all right. Well, here, let's get started in three, two, one. Let's go. And here, let me rotate this so I can make my tower even taller. Come on. Dash, that's not how you play Tetris. I told you. I'm telling you, that's how you play. And boom, there we go. I won. I just built the tallest tower. Dash, that's not how you play Tetris. You're not supposed to hit the top. All right, I'm done sending emails to all my business employees. But uh, guys, is this all this room has? Um, besides the laptops and the arcade machines, that's all there is for this room. All right, well, I guess the cake room is next. And oh, yeah, let's go check out the cake room. I want to see how you made a cake factory. Yeah, this is my favorite room in the house. And it's Speaker Baby Baby's favorite room as well. What? Oh, look at all that baking in the back. And, whoa, yeah, you have like a whole farm and everything in here. This area is actually pretty cool. Yeah, and over here is the employee that makes sure that all the cakes get made. Make more cakes faster. And, oh, wait, is he punching the employee? That doesn't seem very nice. That speaker baby baby, calm down. The cakes are going. Yeah, but I want more cakes now. He doesn't know that there's like a bunch of cakes at the bottom. And wait, what? There's a bunch of cakes at the bottom? And, whoa, what? You have like a whole cake collection system down here. Whoa. Yeah, there's a whole restaurant at the bottom. We'll get there. All right, well, what's the next thing? Well, over here, there's a room that we definitely should not go in too because speaker baby baby cannot control himself and, uh, wait do not enter that's a lot of do not enter signs i'm gonna go inside uh, no speaker baby get out wait come back uh okay i guess we're just going in here now wait, what is all this <laughs> uh, nothing i don't mind this uh, speaker baby baby get out of here right now is this a nuke silo uh, no this room is nothing uh, everyone get out this room is just decoration speaker baby why do you have this room uh, it's just decoration did you not hear me uh yeah decoration that looks awfully like a nuke uh but anyway what else do you have in this tour. Oh, well, if we go down here, we can go downstairs. And, oh, yeah. Can we see that restaurant that you were talking about? I'm curious to see what that looks like. Yeah, I'm hungry. Oh, yeah. It's just right over here. And here is all of the cakes and the cake restaurant. And, whoa. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This area actually does look pretty cool. Oh, cake, 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 cake. I want cake. Give me all the cake. Oh, speaker, baby, baby, get out of there right now. Don't eat all the cake. And, uh, wait, is he eating all the cake? Uh, I'm not sure if that's very healthy. Speaker, baby, baby, get down right now. I'm eating all of the cake. You can't stop me. Speaker, baby, if speaker, baby, baby is your baby, Baby, then is that speaker baby baby's grandpa uh, wait i don't want to think about that i do i am way too young to be a grandpa <laughs> uh, that is technically true yeah i don't want to think about it either speaker baby stop eating all that cake get down and, whoa wait okay he is actually going crazy on this cake uh is it safe to be inside of this machine over here yeah it's just a dropper for all the cakes being produced but speaker baby get out of there right now uh, fine fine sorry i was hungry all right well now that we're done with all that unhealthiness uh what's this over here is this bumper cars and, whoa yeah this is bumper cars it's like the second best part of my house the second best but bumper cars are so awesome uh, yeah but so is a cake factory. Yeah, and wait, there's not enough for everyone. Oh, well, here, I could sit out this round because I've played it so much. Speaker baby, baby, go have fun. Oh, I'm definitely gonna win. Oh, you guys are going down. Pops taught me some tricks. And wait, what, what type of tricks? Did... <laughs> wait, did he just break his own car? Wait, I, does he have lightning weapons? I think I did the maneuver wrong, but you guys are still going down. Come here. And oh, what the? He's got a lightning blaster. Ah! A lightning shot on the loose rail. Oh, guys, oh, gosh, I'm out of here. bumper car. Right, come back here, speaker man. Speaker baby, why do you keep giving everyone? weapons first dash baby and now your own baby listen i'm telling you it's what babies really want i mean i would want one see uh, uh, no uh, you can't be giving babies weapons that's a horrible idea i can't take this anymore i'm going to blow up that tnt uh, wait no speaker baby come back come back come back don't do don't you touch that stop it stop it wait is he blowing up the tnt and um uh, guys we should run we should run go, right go, now go, go, that's my cue run. that's my cue Whoa! oh my gosh uh, he just blew up the entire house oh my god Gosh, speaker, baby, baby, are you serious? Sorry, I just wanted to see what would happen. What in the world? And okay, at least the nuke didn't go off. Uh, guys, what's that sound? I found a button and I pushed it. Uh, wait, I think the nuke is about to go off. We better get out of here. Wait, close the doors. Get out. Guys, I think he pushed the launch button. We got to get out of here. Everyone get on top of Dash's house. It should be the safest one. And, yeah, wait, here, let's see what happens. Oh, no, my cake. I worked so hard on that. Wait, I think I see something blowing up inside. And oh, yeah, okay. Okay, well, uh, speaker baby, your house uh, definitely got destroyed. Oh, no. There's all my hard work gone. Well, I think we just set a new record for the most misbehaved baby. And, uh, wait a minute, guys. I think we forgot about the natural disaster. There's a tornado going on. Oh, gosh. 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 Oh
gosh, oh gosh, I'm going inside of my house. I'll see you guys. Dash, let me in, dash, let me in. Quick, 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 get in. Okay, uh, it looks like my baby's okay. Uh, what in the world is going on? There's like a tornado. Oh, I'm fine inside my house. It's actually calm in here. Yeah, me too. Uh, dash, your house is getting torn apart. Uh, wait, my house is getting kind of destroyed. What in the world? Uh, Dad, I don't think you should have used wood. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit too late for that now. Quick, uh, everyone head into this room over here. This is the most reinforced one. Should have built a base like mine. Oh, gosh, I hope my baby is doing all right. Oh, yeah, what even happened to your baby? I don't know. I think he just lit off the TNT and ran away. My roof is being torn apart. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Yeah, this isn't good. My house is also taking a lot of damage, but hey, at least my baby is still alive. Uh, Dash, look on top of the roof. The gorilla is there. And wait, what? The gorilla is there? Oh, gosh. Well, uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Gorilla. Oh, gosh. I just hope my baby is all right. Uh, guys, I found another button. And uh, wait, what? I think your baby is more than all right. Uh, wait, guys, what's going on? Everyone duck for cover. Oh, I think he found the other button in my base. Oh, wait, no. what's going on, Dad? Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, everyone watch out. Uh, guys, I'm pretty sure there's going to be an unnatural disaster. <laughs> oh, gosh, oh, gosh, everyone get ready. Wait, what's happening now? And, oh, my gosh, what in the world? Oh, wait, my house is fine. My baby. Wait, that's your house actually survived a little bit. I'm alive. And oh my gosh, everything just got destroyed. What in the world? That was pretty crazy. And if you want to watch the next video, then click on the video on the screen right now.